we've just got here this is our room she's very cutesy i did think it would be bigger but i feel like i say that every time i book somewhere but she is very cute we've got a very random view downstairs in the hotel is lovely as well we've got a mirror here the tv suitcase we also have this big mirror on the bathroom door which is amazing and then in here is the bathroom gone for a blue vibe and look how big this mirror is as well how oh god so much space for like getting ready and stuff in here i could put on my makeup on here yay how exciting and the stuff is really really lovely so off to a good start Good morning everyone, I hope you're all doing good. We kind of just wrote yesterday off a little bit so we didn't really end up getting up too much but today is somebody's birthday, how exciting. And now we're just having food in the hotel and it is really nice. I had some yogurt with not granola, just like different nuts and then fruit. And then I just had a bread roll with cheese, chicken, and butter. <laughs> Stunning. It was so nice. We've got a big empty plate here. And then I've got a banana. I've got a latte. And I've had an orange juice. Oh, and a cup of water. It's only 25 past nine. At home, it would only be 25 past eight. So we might go back for a little sleep when we go on. We'll see how we feel. And then, yeah, we're going to go out and have a day full of adventures in Milan. I've actually just been corrected. It was apple juice, not orange juice. Didn't realize I said that, sorry. But cheers, happy 25th birthday, you yeah, old man. This is today's outfit, full outfit is Topshop. Little Topshop, net, not netted or knitted, lace skirt. This t-shirt is Meg's, this is from Topshop. I absolutely love the back. Can you see that properly? I just thought it was giving very Italy, you know. And this is her makeup. And we've got Sunny's. And just my little Sambas on. And we're just about to go and head out now. I'm getting hungry again. So I'd like to eat. And do shopping maybe. Just see where the day takes us. Just go and explore, you know. This is the first after all of Milan and she's absolutely gorgeous. We're having a little after all and some crisps before we go to dinner and we've had such a lovely day just shopping, having a wander around. Everywhere opens for dinner like quite late here, like a lot of the restaurants open at half seven. The one that we're going to is just like a couple doors down. <laughs> Had the camera in the wrong setting then so it was all a bit dark, sorry about that. But yeah, we're having a really good time, living our best lives. We've done a little bit of shopping. I bought a couple new bits, I'll show you when we get back to the hotel. We've had a great birthday. It's lovely. And I can't wait for some delicious pasta. The food that we had before, I can't even tell you. It literally made me emotional with how amazing it was. Like, what? It was stunning. Yeah, the food was absolutely amazing at lunch. It was so good. And I'm just loving Italian food. It's so good. We don't really go out for Italian food when we're at home because we just... We kind of rather would go to different cuisines. I mostly go to Italians with like my friends or my family. So it's nice for us to have a little bit of a change. But I'm going to have some delicious pasta. And I just can't wait. I've had a great day. 
me to watch you do. Don't get your look so nice, being a nice room. Look what you're putting me through. I never do this to you. I need to hold on. We're now just back near the cathedral and we got an ice cream. I went to salted caramel. There's a man playing live music behind me and it's so bloody wholesome. We're having a great time. <laughs> <laughs> Oh god, we just had the most delicious pasta as well. Don't we remember talking about that, I don't think how. Today's breakfast isn't a healthy option, but it's a delicious one. Today, and we've just come for some lunch. There's loads of people, so I can't really turn you around right now. But I did take some other videos which you may have already seen. So basically, we've come here today because we've got loads of markets which are all just behind. But we needed some food first, so we came to eat, and then we're gonna go have a little nosy at the market. I love a good market. And I want to have a look at some jewellery. I also really want some cowboy boots. But whether I'll be able to find them, I don't know. And I want a cool little Milan cap. And they do have some of them. But there's a specific kind of one that I like. So we'll have a little nose and see what we can find. And we also need to get some little gifts for the fam. Just some, a little token of something to bring home, you know? So far, so good. We're having another amazing day. We're loving life. We are now back at the hotel. We've had another great day venturing out, but I thought I would just quickly show you a couple of bits that I've picked up whilst I've been here. You're currently just balancing on the safe. Is that a bit better? I don't know. First thing, I've really wanted a pinky ring for literally ages, but it's so hard to find because my pinkies are so small. And today I got a silver one and a gold one at these little markets that we found and they feel like quite good quality to be fair but I just thought they looked nice stacked up but it was so hard to literally find some that fit my little fingers we was literally trying on so many so that's literally the only thing that we got at the markets today there was so many markets but that was the only thing that really took all that fancy you know and then we've got a couple of pieces of clothing first thing is this hat now i know it does give tourist but i do feel like it is like a cool vibe what do you think like with a tracksuit i'm here for her and i really wanted that specific one we was going around to so many stalls and nowhere else had it so we had to go back and get that specific one and then from zara i picked up this jumper I just absolutely love the collar. I actually put it on yesterday when we was out for dinner. I put it over my outfit that I already had on. And it just looked so cute and so chic. Is there something on the bottom of the camera? No, you can just see the safe there. Sorry about that. But it's not in. Anyway, then it just goes in at the waist like this. And it's just the most gorgeous colour. Really, really nice. I had this in my basket at home online not my basket my favorite sport extra small and small had literally all sold out so i was so happy when i found it here and i feel like that is definitely something i will keep in my wardrobe forever and quality is absolutely lovely it's very chic gorgeous and then i got this from h and m this is actually from the men's section i've really wanted some like good quality plain 
long sleeve tops but i feel like a lot of them the neck comes like down here and it's like i want the neck up there on a t-shirt you know so i saw this one in the men's section and i thought that this would also look really nice under my new dungarees i feel like i'm not here because i've got a migraine i've just found some tablets and finally taken them but my head is literally pounding and it hurts to even move my eyes right now so you'll have to bear with me this was an extra small that i picked up and it was 10 euro 9.99 and yeah i just thought it was like the perfect kind of long sleeve if you're struggling finding long sleeves that are like up to your neck a good sleeve and not bloody cropped look in the men's section because i found some really good basic tees in the primark men's section as well recently and i'm really happy with them yeah i feel like some of the women's ones at the minute like they're a little bit of an awkward length and i find since i've had my boobs done a lot of tops ride up a little bit and i find crop tops ride up more than they would on someone obviously with smaller boobs and i find it annoying because it's like i don't want you to be a crop top i want you to be longer especially when you've not been going gym and you're not feeling 100 percent you don't want to wear a crop top i talk about it literally in every video but you know what i mean the brush hair is amazing people love him i did find a fur coat that i really really want but i'm just just like trying to tell myself no but i just cannot stop thinking about it i we went past the shop again before but i just was like no i'm not doing it i'm not getting another fur coat but i might end up getting it when i'm back or if i see it in the sale or something and i only ended up leaving that shop with one thing but the birch care was amazing absolutely massive so i picked up these pants i've wanted some like this for a while but because my legs are quite long but slim it's hard to find ones that fit right so i got these ones for 19.99 and i got them in a size small and it is just some joggers but they flare out a little bit at the bottom and they're low waisted which i love and yeah i just really really like how they fit very happy with those i feel like i've got some good bits that are, like staples we also got a pair of trainers and i think that was it i'm more of a shop holic out of the two but yeah i'm very happy with those pieces that we picked up just still can't stop thinking about the body coat you know hello my loves you have come to the end of the video how bloody good was that trip to milan i had a ball and it's exactly what i needed going into our autumn winter perfect little break but i hope you guys did enjoy the little milan vlog it was really nice experiencing a different culture trying different foods obviously italian food is very popular but when you go there it's the proper stuff you know and i just love going and seeing different parts of the world and just seeing how other people live you know i don't know i'm very interested in stuff like that i'm a little bit of a nerd but i just like to see what's going on in other parts of the world but yeah i hope you guys did enjoy and i will see you all in the next video Mwah.